So I have a 50 second clip to share with you to demonstrate how painting is about problem solving. There's no reason why we can't use reference photos or any other tool that will help us to accomplish our goal as artists. But we never want to become a tool of the photograph. <laughs> we want to use whatever tools that we have to follow what's here in our minds. So looking at this clip, you'll notice that in the reference image, there is no rock with this highlight on it. In fact, the reference image doesn't resemble the finished painting really at all. It was just a starting off point for me. And then I followed my instincts, I followed my imagination to create the painting. But in that this little space there, it didn't feel like the water was flowing behind the rocks and coming out well. It felt like that rock, that whole area, came right on over and was all connected. And so where, how's this water coming behind and then suddenly coming out this area over here? That's possible. There's nothing to say that it couldn't happen that way, that there couldn't be some underwater uh, crevice or something like that. But I felt that there was a better way to do it, a better way to to illustrate to the viewer how the water is flowing in that particular spot. So it was problem solving and the thought came to me to put in a highlight and to pull that one section of rock away from the other section of rock. So that's all that this 50 second clip is about, but it's an important demonstration of how to problem solve an area, to use our imagination to not be dependent on any other source, any tool or reference photo or anything like that. We can use our imagination and our own ability to solve these problems to accomplish our goal. All right, have fun with it and happy painting. So I've got all of this coming down as if it's coming over the top of that rock. So I really need to figure out what's happening there because the water's coming through there. I need to have some kind of a stopping to it. There, putting in that highlight, that helped resolve this area right there, I believe. And it actually gave more credence to this whole space, because now this feels like it's in shadow for a reason, and that it comes out of the shadow right here as that cropping sticks out. So that, just that little highlight, helped, helped definitely resolve this area much more than it was.